freaking landscapers and their noise anyway. So you guys know how I take my sweet ass time going over comments and replying to as many of them as I can and it takes me a long time sometimes because I actually have a life, I got stuff to do and it's just not realistic for me to be spending that much time on the channel. There's too many things to manage in life. I just so happened to have seen a comment from four years ago that was criticizing my stream and they said something like your stream was so forgettable I had to replay it also consider investing in a better camera in a better mic your points were just super flawed something 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 you know that shit doesn't bother me but I'm grateful for this person's comment and the fact that I'm seeing it now and I replied to it pretty much saying you don't tell me what to do and how to do something okay but overall I just want to know why is it hard for people to recognize that not everybody is going to be in the optimal position to provide something, to do something, to give something. Do you guys think that in 2016, I was excited about the fact that I was using the built-in camera on my phone, the built-in mic on my phone, and that's all I had to provide, and to this day still have to provide? No! Like, I would love to have the nice green screen behind me. I would love to have that fancy microphone. I would love to be able to take great videos to show more and add sound effects and all that. But it's not where I'm at. And on top of that, it's not what I want to do. I want for this thing to be something that I enjoy. If I start spending a ton of money to make this more appealing and attractive, but my content is going to remain the same. What is the point? I think that people like that think that I'm trying to go far in this video making business and they don't understand my origins. When I started this, I started it because it's something I genuinely wanted to do, genuinely thought about, genuinely enjoyed, and I didn't even know I could make money off this. Because I knew that, that is the thing that keeps me moving, keeps me going. Because when you start something with the right mindset and nothing changes you because you have that well defined and nothing influences you, you stay happy. I'm grateful for the little bit of advancement that I have made. I'm grateful for you guys who have actively supported me along the way in whatever ways that you can. But when it comes to like my overall goal with this, I'm not trying to be one of those people with the million subscribers. That shit scares me. I think I would leave this platform if that ever happened because I can see myself not enjoying it as much as I do now. But for some people, I guess it's just hard to preconceive that and be like, hmm, maybe this person has a more modest way of things and there's a reason for that. Why are people so fucking superficial? Why are you so easily discouraged and impressionable? Imagine if I decided to not watch certain things because they're black and white. Imagine if I decided to be like, oh man, because the quality of the sound is bad, I cannot try to sit through it and see what I can decipher and see what information and what points I can gather. Another thing they said was that it was a waste of their time. So ultimately, what I ended up saying to this person in addition was, this is what you need to do. You need to learn to develop the skill of determining when something is going to be a worthy investment of your time and when something isn't. If within 20 seconds, there's nothing interesting or intriguing or captivating, or you hate the sound, you hate the picture, you hate that person, you hate the voice, you hate the message, whatever it is, all you gotta do is leave and do so quietly. Nobody cares that you don't like the sound. Nobody cares that you don't like my face. And if you're trying to get to me, just know that it has zero effect on me. But what you do accomplish this time around, it was giving me something to say. So thanks for that. I get like this because it's not the first place I see this at. Like someone did this to me, but I see other people saying that. And I'm like, if you're going to say something, say something that actually has an impact, something that's productive something that maybe adds substance to something or maybe you have a question 
but hanging out on the surface it's stupid it's like saying oh i cannot get on this car because my favorite color is blue and i cannot get on a red car imagine if you cared too much about superficial things like that online experience is no different you don't want to listen to this video because the person is not showing their face and instead they're showing a picture that remains static why do you have to be so visually stimulated how about your listening skills or some people are the other way around you're upset that the video has pictures and text but you hate that it doesn't have sound and you cannot make yourself uncomfortable maybe for the seven minutes that that video takes and it's an educational video you just don't want to sit through it because it forces you to use your eyes if you don't have time to do that to be staring at the screen then do something else instead most of the things that i listen to online even if they have a production and video and picture and stuff i can't even watch it in full because i'm in the middle of doing something washing dishes cleaning the house because realistically i don't have the time and i'm actually a great manager of my time and that's how everything gets done everything gets paid i can make it to my commitments on time but can you say the same so anyways you guys i thought i would just throw that out there i know that some of you guys like it when i rant and honestly i like to rant ranting is fun what do you think when you see or hear of someone being like that i personally like to try to roast them however i can but i'm honestly not someone who has that kind of thought or mindset so i'm not a very good roaster or someone who claps back at someone i'm just myself and i'm not going to let anything or anyone change that